see a big hole. Yeah, it's a mud pit, for sure. A mud pit you paid for if you live in one of Missouri's largest counties. I see a waste of taxpayer money. Clay County Presiding Commissioner Jerry Nolte now left to clean up this mess after the county has spent almost $5 million on this property. Any other comments? Um, Nolte has hope after the brand new county commission he's a part of yes. unanimously stopped construction. I think it is the, the past two associate commissioners who decided that this was a, the way to go. Nolte regardless. talking about former commissioners Lou Ann Ridgway and Gene Owen. I believe that this is a, a good decision. Both so supported a $20 million plan to build a big government annex here at 152 in North Brighton. We suggest you listen to the public. But KBC9 covered several public meetings with people telling Owen and Ridgeway, I'm very concerned about you moving forward with that location. For they did not want a new annex spending millions to build it here. Nobody spoke in favor of this, and I think that it's just a complete waste of county resources. KBC9 News has covered several controversies with this annex site for the past few years. Clay County is now stuck trying to figure out what to do next with this land. I think we'll be able to recoup some of the money that's been invested into the land here. New County Commissioner um, John Carpenter says the county can sell this land. Carpenter, along with County Commissioner Megan Thompson and Jerry Nolte, last week supported temporary repairs to the existing annex site at 48th Street. All still discussing what's next for the land at 152 in Brighton. I would prefer to sell it. Let's get rid of it. We don't need it. I have no intention of of having anything built there. Once we've done our homework, we're going to take those possibilities to the people and say, what do you folks think? I think that they're going to try to salvage this. Everyone trying to dig taxpayers out of money spent so far. Matt Fleener, KBC 9 News.